hello everyone welcome back to the map of mathematics in this video we are going to solve this nice algebra problem and here we have 6 to the power of n plus 9 to the power of n is equal to 2 to the power of n plus 2 to the power of 2n plus 1 and we will solve this problem for the values of n so the very first thing we are going to do is here first we will focus on the right hand side and we will apply the nice exponential law in the right hand side and you know that if we have a to the power of m plus n it is equals to a to the power of m times of a to the power of n so now we will use this exponential law in the right hand side so that its right hand side will be written as 6 to the power of n plus 9 to the power of n is equals to 2 to the power of 2 n times of 2 to the power of 1 and after that uh, we will uh, again use an other nice exponential law uh, and you know about this law if we have a to the power of m to the power of n it is equals to a to the power of m times of n now we use here this nice law so that according to this law uh, we will focus on the right hand side and here you have 2 to the power of 2n we will use this law on this term so that this expression will be written as 6 to the power of n plus 9 to the power of n is equals to here i can write this term as 2 to the power of 2 and its whole power n times of 2 so that after applying this law we will simplify the terms and you get 6 to the power of n plus 9 to the power of n is equals to here you have 2 square and 2 square is equals to 4 to the power of n times of 2. After this we will divide both sides by 4 to the power of n so that it will be written as 4 to the power of n and 4 to the power of n and this term is also divided by 4 to the power of n so after this step uh, here uh, we will combine the this exponent and we will write it as 6 over 4 to the power of n plus similarly here we will combine the exponent and you write 9 over 4 to the power of n is equals to here you have these two terms are gone and you get only two so after this step we will simplify the terms and here you, you cancel out these terms so this is cancel out by the table of two so here two three is a six and two two is a four so this will be written as 3 over 2 to the power of n plus here you have 3 over 4 and you will write it as 3 square over 2 square and its whole power n is equals to 2 and now we rewrite this equation as 3 over 2 to the power of n plus here we uh, interchange the exponents and we will uh, we will make uh, upside down this exponent 2 and we make enter this n sign so that we write it as 3 over 2 to the power of n and its whole squared is equals to 2 after this step i will uh, change this exponential equation into the quadratic form so that here i can take y is equals to 3 over 2 to the power of n so that this exponential equation will be will becomes in the form of y plus y squared is equals to 2 and after this step uh, we will uh, solve this quadratic equation so now first i can rearrange the terms and we write y squared plus y we move this 2 in the left hand side and you get minus 2 is equals to 0 after that we will make the factors of this equation and you know that uh, here we need any two numbers whose product is minus 2 and whose sum is plus 1 so here i can write we need two numbers whose product p is minus 2 and whose sum s is plus 1 
so these two numbers are two times of minus one so these numbers are two and minus one so when you multiply two by minus one you get minus two and when you add two and minus one you get plus one so here you have plus y i can multiply this term by y and you get y is equals to 2y minus y so now we replace this plus y by 2y minus y so that the uh, this expression will be written as y squared plus 2y minus y minus 2 is equals to 0 and here we will uh, take common y from these terms and here we take common minus 1 from these two terms so here we take common y and you get y plus 2 and here we take common minus 1 and you get y plus 2 is equals to 0 and now we take common y plus 1 on both of the terms and you get y minus 1 times of y plus 2 is equals to 0 and here we have two cases the first case is we take y minus 1 is equal to 0 and the other case is we take y plus 2 is equal to 0 and in the first case you get the value of y is 1 and in this case you get the value of y is minus 2 so now we will back substitute the value of y and here uh, we take y is equal to 3 over 2 to the power of n so now we will back substitute the value of y so here you put y is equals to 3 over 2 to the power of n is equals to 1 similarly and here you can put 3 over 2 to the power of n is equals to minus 2 so now first we will discuss uh, the second case and here you see that in the left hand side you have an exponential function so you know that exponential function always gives us the positive value and in the right hand side you have negative value so it cannot be possible an uh, exponential function is equals to some negative value so that we will reject it this case because it is not possible case so that now we proceed here this case only and in this case you focus on the right hand side and here you have one and you know that uh, something power zero is equals to one so that you can put this one as three over two to the power of zero so now you focus both of the sides and you see that bases on both of the sides are same so that we will equate its exponents so the the exponent in the left hand side is n and the exponent in the right hand side is zero so this shows that n is equals to zero be the only solution of the given equation and this is our final answer so thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos